Oh yeah. I love watermelon. Oh, wait, I gotta make a phone call. What's up, my dude? What's up, dude? How's it going? It's going. I just got done packing bricks of bulk. What about Yo, you? you got bricks of bulk? I got bricks of bulk right here, too. <laughs> you just... You just got stuff there, Thomas. Yo, I, so much stuff! I need to get rid we'll of just, all this stuff! Yeah, check out his Twitch stream. <laughs> <laughs> My man, with the plugs. Alright, hey, what do you, uh, did you, you, did you open anything new yet recently? You know, I did. I recently recorded myself opening an Napoleon and Tyranitar tin. Okay, okay. Uh, did you open all the packs or no? No, I saved some Sword and Shield packs because I already finished the, the set. You know what? I'm going to pack battle you because I just bought these. I just found these. And uh, mm -hmm. how about we wager? I'll, 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 I'll keep my Sword and Shield base set sealed as well. And uh, okay. if you win this pack battle, I'll give mine to you. Okay, and if you win, what do you, what do you get? Food. Food? Okay, <laughs> bet. Sound good? That sounds good. All right, let's make this happen. Let's go. All right, I lost. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. Right. Not yet. We let's haven't see seen it yet. Video. Hello, hello, YouTube. Questful151 back at it again. Hope you all had a lovely, lovely weekend. I hope you all got some rest. I hope you all got whatever errands you needed to do, and I hope you had a fun weekend. Um, even if you just stayed indoors and chilled, and I hope you had a good time. Okay? So, once again, like our phone call said, we are doing a pack battle today with uh bulbasaur collector good friend of mine uh we're doing the we're pack battling with the tyranitar tin and the wow okay glare come on tyranitar tin and the uh empoleon tin we are saving the he wants to keep his sword and shield base set packs sealed so that's what i'm going to do for him if he wins i'll give him mine if i win he owes me food um, I don't know quite what I'm going to do with my Sword and Shield base yet if I win, but we shall see. Um, let's see, let me get these tins out of the way. Tins always have, have so much packaging, but I do enjoy the... I actually do like the new tin setups now. Um, I actually do prefer this like sort of like covering right here right it doesn't go over it's a different shrink wrap it's kind of plastic um shrink wrap and it has these like frayed edges right here that it just makes it so much easier to open and unwrap plus it also is i feel like it's also a really good measure for preventing um for preventing resealing products because it's a lot easier it's a lot harder to mimic that type of shrink wrap in my opinion um because it's not like your traditional like cling shrink shrink wrap where it just like sticks to the whole thing um it has those lines that can't be imitated so like when they i think when they first introduced it in um shining fates and some of the shining fates and some of the hidden fates tins actually the more recent runs of hidden fates tins had that kind of setup i thought it was really cool and i thought it was a really neat way to prevent resealing so We've got battle styles here. We got Darkness Ablaze. We're saving our Sword and Shield packs for the pack battle. We got Guardians Rising for Sun and Moon. All right, let's do. Uh, we'll do. We'll do battle styles last. We'll do um, Guardians Rising first for both sets. Um, at, yes, this is a you know pack battle with Bulbasaur Collector, but I also do kind of want to see um, which tin gives us the better pull. So we've got the Tyranitar V right here. And we've got the Empoleon V right here. So uh, let's start off with um, let's start off with Tyranitar. All right. So how y'all doing? How was y'all weekends? Um, let's see. Guardians Rising. We are looking for. I think I think Guardians Rising has the um, Hyper Rare Sylveon in it. I think that's one of the chase cards that are, that's in it. Hyper Rare Sylveon Bell Sprout. Reverse Rare Machamp. Um, and a Garbodor. So, I believe that uh, Hollow Rares and Reverse Hollow Rares give us one point. Uh, ultra Rares, Normal Ultra Rares are, so v, v Type and GX cards would be two points. Um, 
what else is there? The full arts are three points, I believe. Full arts are three points. Secret rares, so that's your rainbow rare and your gold cards. Reverse trap inch and a muck. Um, so hyper rares are four points, and then if you get an alt art, it's like an alt art would be basically automatic win. Uh, alt art would be automatic win, I believe. And if in the case that we both somehow pull an alternate art card, then it's uh, points, uh, highest amount of points wins. Let's see. So we got a Gligar and a non hollow rare primate. So Tyranitar tin, you're not looking, uh, you're not getting us points here. Uh, so Tyranitar tin, are, are, are we just looking at a dud tin here? Like, even if we were to open uh, the Sword and Shield base pack, like, would we have a dud tin? Because Battle Styles, you're not being our friendly neighbor today. Frillish, Houndour, Scatterbug, Hone Edge, Gligar, Jellicent, Reverse Rare, and a Stone Journer non hollow. So we've got two points on the board with Reverse Rares. Okay, okay, okay. Sun and Moon, Guardians Rising, come on. Work with me here. Can we get something? Can we get something? Let's see. Uh, I think that was the last code card. Guardians Rising. Come on. Water. Max Potion. Tentacruel. Oh, I'd probably also want the Secret Rare Energies. The Gold Energies, too. Those would be so dope. Vanillite. Gligar. Alolan Sandshrew. And an Oricorio non hollow Rare. Wow. Wow. I, I guess I'm just going to be on a losing streak now. I, I'm just going to be on a losing streak because... My last uh, pack battle that I did with Chin Poco Man, I actually didn't record it. It was just like a random meetup that we had. Um, it was a random meetup that we had, and uh, we did a parking lot, parking lot pack battle with two packs uh, that we just got from Target because we were meeting up, and I lost because I he pulled an Ultra Rare and I pulled two Green Code guards. So rookie none. And Lugia, non-hollow rare. Okay, so seriously, like we're not even gonna we're not even gonna get a hollow rare. All we have on the board for us today is two reverse hollow reverse rares, two reverse holographic rares. Are you telling me that all the hits that I would potentially get from these tins, potentially, there's no guarantee that the sword and shield base set tins would have anything for us? Frillish, Esper, Blipbug, Silly Cobra, Houndour. Reverse Lux Ray Hollow Rare, Reverse Holographic Rare, and a Man Shell. Regular non hollow rare. What the? So we're on the board with three points. We're on the board with three points. Are we. Is this really how we're going to end it? Come on. Can we get some last pack magic? Can we get something in this pack? Can we. At this point, even a hollow rare is still a point. Alright. So we've got Water, Cacturn, Mustard, Cheryl. Yamper, Lickitung, Zubat, Remoraid, Onyx, Reverse Cubone, so not a point there. I'm, I'm nervous now. I don't, I, I'm nervous now. Okay, so now you have to go and check out, like, after I flip this card, um, I don't know, I don't, I don't, I don't know, I'm scared. Tyranitar V. Okay, at least we're on the board with one ultra rare. One ultra rare out of two tins. Not counting the Sword and Shield base packs. What in the... Okay, so we're on the board with an ultra rare Tyranitar V and then three reverse hollow rares. So that's three points that we have. Oh, that's five points that we have. Okay, that's five points. Wow. Like, really? Really? I don't know, man. I don't know. Okay, so now you have to go ahead and check out uh, Bulbasaur Collector's video, uh, video because he also has uh, he has his version of the stuff that he opened. So hopefully that gives us. Well, I guess we'll see. Well, who wins? Who wins? Um, like I said, if he wins, then he gets my Sword and Shield base packs, and if I win, he gets to buy me food. 
Uh, but in any case, shorter video today. I do have more stuff lined up. I have a pretty pretty big collection that I actually just purchased, recently purchased off of somebody. So that will be coming in. I will be showing you that on Thursday. Next week, I'll open the other Pokemon Center ETB that I have because it finally came in. And I'll probably, oh yeah, I got the Blastoise and Venusaur VMAX battle boxes finally. I pre-ordered them a long time ago. Uh, they were supposed to get in like two months ago, three months ago, two months ago, but they finally just came in. So uh, I'll have that next week as well. And then we'll see. I I want to eventually open more Chilling Rain, but we'll just see how it goes. Uh, it depends on what product I find. Okay, I'm done talking now. I hope you all had enjoyed this video. I hope you all enjoyed this pack battle. I'm two for one right now. Uh, and we'll see what the score is after this releases and I see how Bulbasaur collected us. But in any case, I hope you enjoyed it. I know I talk a lot. I probably talk more than I actually open stuff, but I ramble. Have a great day, have a great week, and I will see you on Thursday for another one. Bye!